Hi, welcome to Top Shelf and Brother Beer. Uh, today we're looking at uh, beer cans for parties and barbecues and that kind of stuff. Now don't freak out, a lot of people freak out a little bit with cans and that kind of stuff, but they come in really handy for barbecues and parties, get togethers when you've got a lot of people coming around, they can be pretty good value. They get cold faster in your eskies, your coolers and that kind of stuff. Yes, they do warm up quicker after you get them out, but put them in a cooler or just drink them at a reasonable pace. Um, they also crush, saves a lot of room in your bins and your recycling and that kind of stuff. You don't have like lots of clinking and chinking that your neighbors are gonna hear the next day when you're tipping all your rubbish out. So there's a lot of benefits just in terms of maintaining you know, a, a clean area. We know that there's a lot of uh, standard go-tos that people have uh, in terms of you don't want to spend a lot of money when you've got a lot of people coming over and you're supplying beer, you don't want to have $100 a case and that kind of stuff. So standard ones, you know, your VBs, your Carlton's, Tui's and that kind of stuff. I thought if you want to think a little bit outside the box but still have uh, good value uh, beer cans, um, there's one that I don't have here, which is uh, not a great beer, but it's definitely good value, which is Emu Export, if you can get your hands on it. It's $38 for 30, 375 mil cans. Um, like I said, it's not a, not a great beer, but um, it's certainly quaffable, have it nice and cold. Uh, originated in Western Australia, now brewed in South Australia and Tasmania, and also now owned by a Japanese company. I think it's Kieran as well, so it's actually yeah, got a, it, it's a bit motley. Um, but uh, in terms of larger cans, I like going the larger cans because you know you get a bit more beer for your money. Um, Paps Blue Ribbon USA Lager. Um, that's uh, always a good little go-to. That's uh, it's fifty dollars normally for twenty-four, but you can often get it on sale. Two cases of that for seventy bucks, which is I think that's pretty good value. The Suntory Magnum Dry uh, Japanese beer, but bottled in China. Um, but still uh, another uh, easy drinkable, quaffable uh, lager um, and that is about uh, $55 for 24 of those but these are 500 mil, 473 mil. My standard go to when a lot of people are coming over is just go to the good old Ottinger cans from Germany. I know it says it's a pills, it doesn't quite taste like a pure bread pills uh, to me, it's pretty another pretty quaffable, easy drinking beer. Have these all nice and cold straight out of out of your esky and away you go. They are also 500 mil and 24 of those will only set you back 40 bucks, which I think is a bargain considering uh, 24 bottles of Carlton Draft will set you back about, I don't know, 40 to 45 dollars. Um, and they're 375 mils. So you do get, 24 of these gives you 12 litres of beer, which is great. But yeah, my, my pick of the bunch for value for money is this, but I don't really think you can go wrong with any of these. Um, give them a try and see how your wallet goes, whatever you like. Yeah, don't discount the cans and uh, bring them to your next barbecue or party or just have them in your bath full of ice and a bit of water and, uh, and away you go. Um, enjoy, uh, brother beer out and like and subscribe.